welcome to this class today we are going to balance this reaction this is calcium chloride this is sodium sulfide this is calcium sulfide and this is sodium chloride okay to balance this reaction at first we have to draw a table like this this is reactant site and this is product site in the reactant site we have calcium which is one then we have chlorine which is two then we have sodium which is two then we have sulfur which is one in the right hand side we have calcium which is one then we have sulfur which is one then we have sodium which is one then we have chlorine which is one okay to balance this reaction at first we have to balance the number of calcium chlorine sodium and sulfur from both sides of this reaction so let me first balance calcium right okay calcium one one so calcium is already balanced here chlorine is two but here chlorine is one so chlorine is not balanced so to balance the chlorine what can i do here i can simply multiply here by two that gives me two the rule is that if you multiply by something that something must come before the atom this chlorine has come from here so you have to place here two if you place your two the number of sodium will be two so you need to update the number of sodium and the number of chlorine will be two already you have written right look now sulfur one one so sulfur is balanced then sodium two then sodium two so sodium is balanced then chlorine two then chlorine chlo chlorine two chlorine is ba balanced then calcium one calcium one so calcium is balanced so everything is balanced so you can say that this is the balanced equation balanced chemical reaction so thank you for viewing this video be well